Oh. Oh, this isn't so funny. I wish I'd had the extra reroll. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's Crimson Fox's Chaos. Well, if I win this game, then I might be able to take him over. Oh. 14-3-3. I need to just get the... Actually, just get the uh, re-roll. Rather than a wizard. <sighs> He's got three tackle, yeah. Shit. Two tackle mighty blow is going to be a pain in the ass. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen players. Two sure hands, what the fuck? Don't understand. I haven't got any guard. So the ogres might be able to bully him. Could get an extra apple. Just don't think I'll need it. We could get a star. Nobbler. I don't like him though. Buy him. Is a fowler. No shit. This is going to be horrible. This is going to be absolutely horrible because. He obviously, he was top two, wasn't he? He was top two chaos last season, with me. Beat out Andy Davo for the uh, for the chaos spot last season. So he certainly, he certainly a good player. And then he's got the TV advantage with chaos, and I've got August. So, yeah. Go there, then I've just got to move one before he throws his bomb. May I just use him as a goblin for the half. Not even use his bomb, just use him as a fucking goblin. Hello, freak, happy new year. Yeah, he probably won't concede anybody here, it's killer, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> oh god oh he's got two guard I thought he had no guard oh god he's got two guard oh. oh maybe I should have got an apple maybe I should have just got two apples 
I don't know. This is looking horrible, isn't it? I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> Brando. Hopefully he'll still be alive. In the hopefully Brandil the Ogre will still be alive when Brandil the human returns. We really need him to get the extra reroll there. Huh? Wow, that's a bit that's that's a bit harsh, Jelly. Come on. That is that is not very funny or nice. So, and then I'm right. You know what? No need for that. That was a bit. That was a bit nasty. I thought. That was that was that was pretty harsh, yeah. Save us your presence and don't come back. It's pretty harsh. That is pretty harsh. Just because you know, it's it's one thing joking about the player brand, here, but you didn't know. That is simply not true. The data <laughs> does not support your assertion. Blitzing with mighty blow, sees. He's already that that alone is putting him above most people in call. Oh wow, he's rolled two scores in one turn. Oh my god, I can score. Oh my god, I can actually just score. Oh holy shit. I do this the greedy way rather than the sensible way. So I get to hit him and maybe kill him. Oh baby. Oh baby. Right. So now you can blitz and clear the tackle zone. The only thing is, I don't want to lose the leader, but I've got the extra ones anyway, so... Hit him! <laughs> oh no, he got injured! Oh no, I lost the leader! You can GFI to pick it up. And I could. Why did I throw the leader? Because he's moving at eight. So if he'd, if he'd landed here. We could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, that was why, because he's moving eight. So that that was the problem with throwing a leader. It was a leader or a diamond tackle anyway, wasn't it? Could make loads of GFIs to foul him. He could go there to base him. I really wanted to do the pickup so I could 
you know, go and foul, try to foul him. Yeah. Why not a DT? Because I wanted the extra, I wanted the extra two squares of movement. And the GFIs. But yeah, maybe it was stupid, alright, because it was the fucking leader. I, I know that. I know it was a bit fucking stupid to, to do it on the leader. But... You know, I just thought the extra movement. But yeah, I shouldn't have done. It was... Yeah, I shouldn't have done. You're right, I shouldn't have done. It's not worth losing a reroll for a match. For the extra movement. But, you know, I thought... Because it was more desperate, wasn't it? It's because I thought I have to score this turn. Essentially, I thought... I should have put a thing on there, shouldn't I, in case it went... I thought, against... Uh, against Crimson Fox, in order to win, I'm going to have to score this turn. Like, do you know what I mean? I just thought I was going to have to score this turn. And having a movement eight guy instead of a movement seven guy gives me more chance to score this turn. That that was that was why I did it. Maybe it was wrong. Right. Two plus in to get the ball here. Can I? No. I put a player in there, block him, get him away, and then it's a two plus in with him. One, two, three, four, five. Could put another player in there, and then there's only one block, isn't there? Could throw a bomb, but throwing bombs is fucking shit in there. He could go there, and then he could block him. And then push him... onto the ball. Push him out and then dodge in. No, because I've got to dodge that way to get it. So I'm going to go this way. Be a three plus in there, wouldn't it, with him? One, two, three, four, five. Maybe just blitz him and consolidate.
his guards are split up, which makes it harder to get one of these, doesn't it? There's an annoying bonehead there. Yeah, I'm just using him as a goblin for a half for 60k. He can run straight through, but he can't. Uh, he can't protect the ball if he runs straight through. But if he makes a power here, but if he gets a ball down, he's, so he's got a reroll. This is ball down. You know, he gets the power basically. But yeah, he's got a screen here, but I've got the break tackle again. Oh fuck off! Should have got apples, shouldn't I? I should have got the apple over the fucking goblin for a half. I just run, run out of time, didn't know what to do and everything. I got the break tackle here though. Goes for the one dice. Of course. Of course it succeeds. Why wouldn't it? I can get a couple of ogres in now though. I guess he could go for the blitz, and then if this is a four, then he can go for the hit. Or he could just blitz. And then stand, and then get two people on him. Fucking tough game, this, isn't it? It's pretty good though, having all these guard guys in here. He's facing the ball with strength five, stand firm is uh, is all right, isn't it? Ok, 
occupied is occupied two players. That's not well done. Well done, Johnny Derp. <laughs> Bold if he'd gone through that way, wasn't it? Oh, fuck off, man. Don't need these one dice to be power fucking removals. Fucking hell. Come on, he's chaos. He's chaos. <laughs> Against fucking ogres. Let him have bad dice, not good dice, please. Oh, I didn't stand the guy up first. Never mind, eh? I've got to. Oh, fuck off, man. Uh, anyway, that was where why I don't reroll boneheads, and this game has gone to shit. Apple's gone. I might as well just concede now, eh? I think. I think it's probably best to concede at this point. Ugh. <sighs> Fucking hell, it's all gone tits. So it went so well at the start as well. Uh, if that, you know, removing the claw and then getting to do the fucking passive. I mean, if he hadn't been, if he had just landed and not died, then I could have just scored. And this went up for a three dice that wasn't even a three dice. I should save my fucking ream. An absolute fucking prick. Right. Serve him up to get fucking mighty blow killed. I've beaten this guy three times before. 
Worst possible matchup. I rolled a one. No, <laughs> oh, baby, it's not, yeah. Ah, this is fucking bullshit though, this game. To be fair, apart from his quad skulls on turn one, everything's gone his way. No, I probably shouldn't have thrown, gone all in, thrown the leader. It was the best play to score. It gave us the best chance of scoring that turn. But it was a lot to lose, losing the reroll, wasn't it? I mean, you rolled two double scores in the first turn, gives a, and removed the claw. Like the first turn couldn't have gone better. But since then, it's been a shower of shit. No, he's got reserves, so he's just gonna fall in. And he's got dirty player too, so I probably should have stood him up. I mean that's why I'm so sad just because it started so perfectly. Like if it had just been, if it had just started where he made two removals on the LOS, and he had the ball in a cage, I'd be like, oh well, I had no chance. But it's just it was so it's annoying to get so lucky at the start that gave us the chance, and then to have it robbed feels bad. Enough. Two. I know it was one with the chaos, wasn't it? And then probably one early on. Well, it's still a chance, I guess. Oh, this guy's doing that. If his claw stays out. Get the one turn here. Then uh we still have a chance, isn't there? I wish I'd save the re-roll though. That, that's why I never ever re-roll fucking boneheads normally. 
and I shouldn't have done that time. It was really, really, really bad reroll. Yeah, I haven't conceded in the last week. I, I've literally conceded once with the uh, once with the chaos, and then I guess the other concession must have been early in the season. I only remember conceding once, which was uh, which was with the chaos, which was against a stupid, stupid kill team. Who, funnily enough, conceded conceded to me the next time we played. Stupid that he's got three tacklers though, isn't it? For fuck's sake. Like, what is up with that? Which Chaos team has three tacklers? <laughs> this, is, this is almost an unwinnable matchup, but it was just the hope. It was the hope at the start was the fucking killer. That was the fucking killer. Yeah, five, yeah. The hope at the start. And that's why I went with that's why I went for the leader, because I thought, you know, he's got more movement, more chance of scoring. I guess I shouldn't have done. Let's take the down and tackle off so we can't die. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Like this or something? No, that's where they were, is it? No, like this. One, two, three. Murder. Murder goats on the other last first. That's got to be the best play. Brand Hill back <laughs> is either a, a short range option or also a uh, one, two, three, four, five throw. best place to stand is to get these. It's going to come down this line, isn't it? Maybe. Uh, I, I just really don't know. He's not, they're not adding much by going there. Maybe they could go forward. Maybe even two forward. They can go one, two, three, four, five. It's like here. Someone should work out how best to fucking do a throw teammate, shouldn't they? Hello, Villa Hobby. My kick. Oh, it's handy, isn't it? Very good. Right, but do 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 the punches first. They've got more chance of like doing something. Tackle, two tackle there, so this side is better in terms of tackle. Oh, 
All right. <laughs> Leave it up till Brandhill the, the QB. Brandhill has found his niche. He's a tosser. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> we thought all this time he was just a shit ogre. It turns out he was a pacifist quarterback. He's the, he's the Tom Brady. He's the Tom Brady of August. <laughs> he's got no physical ability. <laughs> he can pass. <laughs> yeah, Tom Brand. <laughs> yeah. Uh, gotta love Fash there. <laughs> Fucking stupid game this is. Yeah, <laughs> Tom, Tom Brandhill. Oh my god, there's half a chance. I mean, it's a shame he's got the claw back because now. Now it's not looking so good. Now reality is about to set in and be like, well. Maybe loads of guys down. I guess just carrying on a break tackle guy. He's got three tackles, so carrying on the blood joker isn't even that good. Carrying on a break tackle ogre, so if he gets marked, he can try to do something. Carry on a snot. Seems incredibly risky with so much tackle and <sighs> block and mighty blow. I don't want to take a block guy out of the out of blocking. So okay, we'll go with Brandhill again. At the end of the day, I don't even need a score, I just need to fucking protect the ball, don't I? As long as I can just not, not get scored on. That's essentially a win. <laughs> I can hear Two, three, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. No, I think one four is fine. And then there's one back. side to side, isn't it? Against, uh, against chaos. Seems fucking fair.
Aye, well done, Brandhill. <sighs> Be mad for sure. Yeah, I I'm mad because I got so fucking lucky at the start. Yeah, I have, his, I have my chatty muted, yeah. Hello, hello, Crimson Fox. Um... Oh, Sam Davies. Yeah, he, qu he effectively quad skulled. He double skulled twice on the first turn. Um, so it was like an affected. It was an effective quads on the first turn, which which is what gave me the hope. Which is why I was pissed off. Because normally, I mean, <laughs> you would expect to fucking get hammered in this game. Obviously, with these teams, I would have expected it. But the fact that I got such hope at the, on the first turn was ridiculous. It was ridiculous to have so much hope on the first turn. And then it was crushed. Yeah, it could have been a worse first turn, to be fair. But now, now all the cars are going to come in and it's going to be shit. Or maybe, maybe not. Telling me there's a chance. There's a guard there. I have an assist here. Let's make it an ogre assist. Now I want the ogres to. Stay where they are. Ah, oh, he's not guard though. No, it has to be him. To make the push good enough. Didn't need guard though, did I? So I was just being stupid. I can re-roll it if it's a fucking both down, can I? I'll try to try to move the ball first. Could be going worse. <laughs> um, why did Fast say that? I didn't say that, Skuramezzo. I said he has no. He physically, he's not a specimen, is he? <laughs> if his job was to be a, if his job was to be a nose tackle, he would be shit. <laughs> <laughs> which is obviously what you'd expect from a um which is what you'd expect from an ogre but it turns out um it turns out that he was a uh a, a quarterback all along <laughs> well, he's not the fastest though, is he? Do you know what I mean? I'm not talking about his health. <laughs> I'm talking about <laughs> who's more who's more who's more physically dominant, Vince Wilfork or Tom Brady. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, Skuro. As an ogre, right? You would want Vince Wilfork, wouldn't you? Big Vince. Get him in there. But it turns out that that Brandhill wasn't Vince Wilfork. 
we all thought he was shit because he was trying to be Vince Wilfork, but it turned out he was actually Tom Brady. I'm not to- fuck right. Okay, Skuro, seeing as you're arguing for no reason, <laughs> I'm talking about Brandhill the Ogre, who hasn't got any any star player points at all, but he's thrown two snotlings for touchdowns. Right? It was just joking because he was an ogre who isn't good at punching things but he's good at throwing snotlings. So I said, he's like, t- turns out he's Tom Brady. Fucking fash. <laughs> Fucking fash. Man, now I know where fash bang comes from. Oh, God. I've just got to blitz him, haven't I? But I've got to blitz the other one. I've got to leave him. Fuck. Freed up Tony. Good. Good, good. 3D. Oh, you bastard! Oh, you fucking bastard! Might have gotten away with it. Of course it's a fucking push. Fuck off. (laughs) Can't believe the rock fucking removed a player as well. Like there's any need for fucking chaos to fucking remove a player from a fucking rock. Holy shit. I would never ever insult Tom Brady, Skurometa. I think he's the greatest of all time. There is no quarterback I would want to have instead of him as a quarterback. However, as an ogre, I would think he isn't ideal. I would rather have Vince Wilfork or, you know, somebody like that. That that was the point. But physically, obviously, Cam Newton is physically superior, isn't he? So I would never, ever, ever want Cam Newton as my quarterback instead of Tom Brady. But there you go. (laughs) Yeah. Oh yeah, Dan Marino. Dan Marino is really good, to be fair. Imagine if Dan Marino had been on the Patriots instead of Brady. Like, who knows what he would have been? Who knows what he would have done? Oh man, one D powers. Just, just for the salt. God, didn't break it. This, this guy's annoying. That's a not one D power. You know what I mean? I'm like two dice push, two dice push. Try to three dice, bonehead. <laughs> and then, okay, it's just like one D power. Get over it. Get over it. Marino was a loser. Well, he was famous. He was he was really good. To be honest, Dan Marino was really good. If you think Dan Marino isn't isn't really good, then you're wrong. But it is hard to, to say anyone else is the greatest of all time apart from Brady. Um, unless you like being wrong. <laughs> why isn't I've got a guard? Why isn't? Oh, there's an extra player there. I didn't see. All right. All right. I want to hit him, don't I? Because he's got mighty blood. But then he's got claw. So hitting him would be good too. He could block him away. With his help.
He didn't die, but he can get gang fouled by snots. Which would be good. He's got to just stand up. Maybe he could get three dice and leave the claw and then just consolidate the cage. I can't three dice him unless I take away an assist from this foul. I guess winning is the most important thing. After we roll it, oh, hey, well, we got the stun at least. This is going to be brutal, isn't it, this? Four turns. Still got time to get forward. Yeah, exactly. That's true, Targaryen Tantrum. Yeah. Yeah, I guess, I guess actually, yeah, that's all you can judge it by, isn't it? Is how much better he was than the rest. Because obviously the people now are better than Pelé. But, like, you know, Messi isn't that much better than everyone else. As Pelé was better than everyone else at the time, I guess. But obviously, Messi's better than Pelé. And Cristiano Ronaldo's better than Pelé. And probably most people playing today are better than Pelé. <laughs> Not most people, but you know what I mean, a lot of them. Yeah, exactly, Targaryen Tantrum, exactly. They're, they're just like, so like, there'll be a lot of people better than Pelé now, so. <laughs> Sad reality, isn't it? Being old. <laughs> yeah, but he, he, he didn't have them though, did he? He didn't have them, that's the point. You know? So... <laughs> this fucking stand firm. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright, can I try to switch sides or just brute force down this side? I think brute forcing down this side is the is the play. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> got him! Got one! <laughs> oh yeah! Pretty good. Oh yeah! Oh god! Oh. Holy shit! He could go there, and then he could th he could two dice him, and then he could come out. One, two, three, four, five. Say hello to my little friend. I want to kind of make this three dice, don't I? But then... Also... Don't. Don't have failed dodges. I don't want him 
just be able to minus two dice now. didn't get as far forward as I wanted. I thought I could push down that side, but I just didn't. Did not push down that side. Completely did not push forward. But... One, two, three, four, five. There is time to win this still with three turns left. He's not ridiculously better than Ronaldo, though, is he? <laughs> In Brit Augustus. Like, oh shit, he got him. Like, what's he called? Pele was like a colossus compared to everyone else, wasn't he? he really was. He what? He's what like made football professional, wasn't he? Like. Messi isn't that much better. It's just because he's a bit messy. It's just because he's a bit better that it's noticeable, isn't it? You know, like because the 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 margins are so small. Base the ball. Hope dirt. Base, base, base. This won't fail. No oh, man, the one dice pounds. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off with your one dice pounds. <laughs> I'm fucking ogres. I need, I need you to not one dice pal things. All right. Oh god, that was a- No, 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 no! Oh! Oh, no! Fucks! This is- See, I'm thinking about fucking football and shit. And fucking awesome doped up Tour de France's. And then I'm fucking doing this shit.
If I'd made the fucking two plus dodge there, pick up, he could have gone there, he could have stunned, thrown him and I could have scored. But no. Gonna fucking lose this game because of a six plus fucking dodge. Oh, fucking hell. Gotta focus, haven't I? That's, that's on the sheet. It should be number one. Fuck chat. Alright. Fuck chat. I'm sorry. It's hard. It's hard to, to, to talk to chat all the time, so I'm just gonna try to care less about chat and more about not being shit. I've got to fucking concentrate more on the game, haven't I? Brilliant, brilliant. Last frogman dies because of it. Fantastic. Fan fucking tastic. Zun's already on the team. I'm, why am I looking at chat? I've got to fucking concentrate on playing Blood Bowl. Yeah, I get myself a Zun here. Yeah, I yeah, I'm on the team. Yeah. Oh, well, finally something fails. He can't, he's got one guy in range, so he gets blitzed. And then if I move him, I guess this failing doesn't matter. It's pretty annoying because I, I don't want to fucking take his tackles on away. He's got one scoring threat. Just hit him. Yeah. Alright, good. Throw an ogre. Right, he can't score, so it's a draw. Okay, thank fuck for that. Thank fuck for that. But sad that I didn't get the chance to win. And the draw was assured, I think. I think I had a chance of a win. If I just made that block even then, I could have maybe done it. Good old brown tail base in the ball. There's no point though, is there? I've just realised. <laughs> now it just might give him a chain. Some outrageous, ridiculous chain using the entire team. Could've won. Could've fucking won. Are oh, these fucking dodgers? Yeah, and the dead ogre sucks, yeah. <laughs> yeah, potato. <laughs> Oh man. AV9 isn't, but AV8 is pretty bad. When he's like, you know, stand firming all the time. 
Like I want, he want, he's a line, he's a line holder, you know. His job is to stand on the line and get punched on defense, which. Auditions to become my son. No, no, I don't know. Zunk's the main attraction of the stream, isn't he? That's the thing, so. <laughs> Just, it's just so frustrating to be that stupid, you know? Just to fucking make the dodges. That, that's what pisses me off the most. More than anything. It's just a dumbass mistake like that. And I've done it three times now. And it's been... It's been in fucking super important. Like, super important every time. Brando finally got SPPs there. And that could have been a win if I just hadn't fucked it up massively. Same as, uh... It's a prick faggot. Oh, prick tigers. Um, that's that's the annoying thing, you know. Like he couldn't help his fucking two double scores in one turn. That it was questionable whether it was right to throw the leader or not. But just fucking making a six plus dodge that I didn't see. Just fucking grinds my gears. I can't replace him anyway for the next game. Add two snot. Makes it so there's 14 players on the team. So I guess he doesn't get sacked. Just got to check for him. Mm. But, um. <laughs> MVP of the dead guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, that was pretty good, wasn't it? For To draw somebody as Olgers against Chaos. Who were the second place chaos last season? You know, he finished above. He finished above Andy Davo with chaos last season, so he's in the top. Th we were, you know, he was part of the three three horse race to get top chaos. So, and I drew and could have won, so I should be happy. But I'm just mad at myself for that six plus dodge that I just didn't see. Like for the third time it's happened, or maybe even more with his team when it's been super costly. Pretty disappointing. Um, oh, glorious! Glorious! Thank you very much, Glein UK. Klein UK, even not Glein. I don't know why I said Glein. But thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.